Hi, everybody. I wanted to say a brief word about our class and the papers in it and ChatGPT. It's well known by now, I think, that ChatGPT can help with research for papers and for discussion threads and all kinds of things. I want to explain why our class has a policy against this. Let's start here. If there was a machine which would lift weights for you in the gym, I don't think you'd do it. Why? I think you know why. It's because you're going into the gym to get stronger. You want to gain more power physically. You want to be able to do different things. And you also hope that that strength will be noticed by other people in the world. You're increasing your physical power and that's going to benefit you and anyone that you can help with that power. The same is going to be true with your writing and your thinking. When you work out ideas, when you think them through, when you write them out on a piece of paper, you get stronger, mentally, intellectually stronger. You understand yourself better. You and your world become bigger, more complex. You become a more interesting person. You are growing. When you use ChatGPT, just as if you had a machine to lift weights for you or maybe run the track for you, you're going to deprive yourself of growth. And that's why you shouldn't use it. Okay, you might be thinking, but what about all those dumb assignments, the ones that don't make any sense or that I don't care about? Well, I think that ChatGPT might be tempting for those, but it's often hard to know what a teacher has in mind. And I think it's up to you to take a leap of faith to trust the teacher to make an assignment that's going to be beneficial to your growth. These leaps, these leaps of faith to trust the teacher are the basic currency of all education. So in our class, I have made a very large effort to create assignments that are low risk and that are high growth. These include the papers for the class, the discussion threads, and I think that if you put in some effort, you're going to see that they're going to be rewarding for you in both in terms of your grade, but also more importantly in terms of your growth. So I don't want to be a policeman for you. Uh, I don't want to be a policeman about the assignments for the class. Uh, so I'm making this plea to you and I'm asking you to trust me about the assignments and to invest in your own growth. Thanks for listening and I hope this makes sense. Feel free to email me about any comments you have about this or questions, um, but thanks.